feeding children is crucially important. Here we are in the 21st century in one of the richest nations in the world, in one of the richest provinces of our nation, and we have thousands of children who are hungry. We're not in an, in an area of the city where we have parents who can come into a kindergarten classroom and provide a snack daily and rotation schedule. That's what a lot of kindergarten classes do. Unfortunately, we just don't have that. Because a lot of our kids also don't have breakfast in the morning, we're providing breakfast for them. It's really sad when you see kids falling asleep because they haven't had enough to eat, you know, and they're tired. You know, and it, it can affect their learning and their grades if they're hungry. You, you can't learn. It's just not possible. And some of our kids come to school to have something to eat for lunch. I think that's part of our attendance is because we provide food. And you think that this is something that happens in LA or New York. It's right here in Edmonton. The need is here. And not just in the inner city either. I mean, there's a lot of schools that need it. We were fortunate to receive the Edmonton School Lunch Program five years ago. What this program has done for us is helped us to create a more focused learning environment in the school because we do believe that a full tummy helps to create an open mind, helps to create a focused learner, helps to create a positive sense of well-being because you're healthier. And we have seen a reduction in behavior incidents in this school over the past five years. During the school year, um, we facilitate young chefs cooking programs with grades four to six. They're learning basic skills in the kitchen. Sometimes older kids are having to prepare food for younger siblings at home, so they find it useful in that way. When the school year ends, we switch over to our summer snack program because we find in the summertime there is the huge gap when there are not a lot of the programs that go on during the school year. We also provide community garden space where people can grow their own vegetables to improve their nutrition. These are some of the things that we should be doing right across the city to help people with modest income to have good nutrition. For the kids to actually get to grow and plant and see what happens when you put a seed in the ground. It's an amazing feeling because a lot of kids in the city have no idea at all where food comes from. Children who don't have adequate food have less success in school. They leave early, therefore their employment chances are more limited. Could we make a change? What would that change look like in our community? If we had children with adequate nutrition, what would their school experience be like? What would their school success look like? If they succeed in school, then their employment opportunities are greater. It all begins with very fundamental things. Food, a safe, healthy place to live, and people that care about you. And your world expands exponentially in terms of what you can be, what you can do, and what your future is. How many hungry children does it take to matter? Does it take 20% of the population? Does it take 10% of the population? Does it take one child? If I'm that one child who hasn't eaten since yesterday's supper, it matters to me. And if I'm that one teacher who has hungry children in my classroom, it matters to me and it matters to the learning that is happening in that classroom. I've been in other schools and they don't do this. It's, this school really cares a lot about the students. The biggest thank you, don't know the difference that you're making in so many kids' lives. Like it's not just in, in one or two kids' lives, it's a whole school that you're making a difference for.
you're really giving back to the community and to your own community, which I think is also really important. I don't think that there's any greater message that we can give these kids and their families that we care about you and we want you to be as successful as you can be.